in this sum length is 150 height is 75 and width is 80 so now if you see in this sum first we will start with front view this portion then we will draw this and then we will start with top view and side view so first we will see front view in front view we have 15 and a rectangular block of 15 so we'll take 15 from here and we'll draw a line then after that if you see the main diagram they have given 50 from here to here and they have given this slope which height is 25 and you have to leave 25 from here so what we will do we will mark 50 from here take 25 from here and go up by 25 and join this so we have drawn that slope after that if you see the main diagram this part is there which is rectangle height is 15 so we'll take height 15 and we'll draw this rectangle now after this we have to draw this dovetail slot if you see in this main diagram they have given 55 from here then 10 10 go up by 15 again 20 20 so we'll draw this part we'll take 55 from here and we leave 10 10 on both the sides again we'll go up by 15 and we'll leave 20 20 on both the sides and we'll join now after this if you see in front view see the main diagram then you see from the front you won't be able to see this edge as well as this circular edge right so what we will do how much you have to go inside you have to go inside by 25 go down by 40 and draw horizontal line and for this circle we need to draw one dot line so what we will do we will go inside by 25 we will go down by 40 and we will draw horizontal line We need to draw 15, we need to draw radius 15 dot line also if you see the main sum, this part. So from top we need to go down by how much? 15 and we need to draw dotted line. So we are done with front view. Now we will draw top view. So now when you see the main diagram, from top you will be able to see this part, this slope and this circle. This radius is how much? 25. This total is how much? 80. So it will be how much? 50. Then they have given 10, 40, 10. So how much it will be? 660. And if you see over here, the remaining distance would be how much? 10, 10. Okay. So first we will start. First we will start with this part, and then we will draw this circular part. We take. 10 from 15 from here, we'll go inside by 10 and extend. This will be dark. Then we can project from this part. Again, we can take 10, 10 on both the sides. We can extend this line which is from here if you extend project this now this we will extend but we don't know where to stop so for that we need to refer front view wherever it will intersect from there we have to project down so we will get the exact length where we need to stop if you see the main diagram, see this part. This length is not mentioned, but they have mentioned this. So what we have done, we have projected from there. So we'll get the required distance. Now, when you see from the top, see this circular portion, it will appear as a rectangle. So these two lines are important. So that is, how much is this radius? 15. So this total diameter would be how much? 
30. So what we will do? From center, we'll go up by 15, we'll go down by 15, and we'll draw a line. After that, now see in main diagram, there is a slot, which is 5 mm, which is passing through this part. So what we need to do over here, from the center, we need to take 2.5 up, 2.5 down, and we need to draw slot, which is through and through. And if you see, there is a radius 25 also, so that also we can draw. Now, due to the slot, we will have one dotted line in front view. See this in the main diagram. When you see from here, you won't be able to see this edge, the, the line which is going through and through. So, what we will do from here, we will draw dotted line. Now, we will draw side view. Now, see the main diagram. When you see from the side, you will see this circular portion. Then, then you will see this rectangle, then you will see this slope and you will see this circular part. So what we will do, first we will draw step by step, circle, rectangle and one more thing, when you see from the side, you will see these two rectangles also which are going through and through. So that also we will draw. This you can project from 45 degree as well. Then we will draw a circle. But we know there is a slot in the circle. Project this two line. If you see the slope, 10, 10. And we project from front view. This we need to extend. After that, this part that is from your front view will project and when you see inside view you can see this circular part also that also we can draw from the center we can draw radius 15 now after that when you see from the side there is one more thing which you can't see. When you see from here, you won't be able to see this dovetail slot which is going through and through. So what we need to do, we need to draw a dotted for that. So that dotted will be appearing in this portion. So we need to draw one dot, three dot. Why? Because it is overlapping with the dark line. So that's why we are not able to see continuous dotted line. So we need to show like this. Now, we will come across one more thing. This portion will be dark and this portion will be dark. Why? When you see from here, you can see this line now. It is full as well as at the bottom. So these two lines will be dark. Now we will draw sectional front view along AB. If you see this, cut plane line is passing through like this in the mid middle of the object or it is passing through this object like this. AB. So what we will do, we will cut this object, we will imagine that if you cut this object how it will look. So we will remove this portion.
it will appear like this and this much portion will get hatched see we won't be hatching this part because if you see the main diagram it is not cut there is a slot in between so your cut cutting plane line is passing through and through it is not cutting this portion so over here we won't be doing hatching and one more thing in top view we need to draw if you see the main diagram this part is there as well as these four dotted lines are there this dotted slot is going through and through so we need to draw a dotted line for all these four edges so that we will do it from here this will be dotted this will be dotted remember that it won't come in this part it will come only in this part and this this much portion will be dark and then dotted why because this and this they are coinciding now we will do hatching so for the hatching we need to remove this part it is always advisable to draw light front view and then you need to